significantly in this operation we saw not only human trafficking but the human traffickers diverting the victims into a series of secondary criminal acts. The profile of the traffickers was interesting too and of the 14 suspects that were identified and arrested, 12 were women and I think this um, belies the, the stereotype that most people have that human traffickers are predominantly men, not in this case. The victims on many occasions were diverted to other activities. The gold mines near Khartoum was, was one of those activities. Uh, the children in those cases were, were forced into illegal gold mining activities, forced to work with dangerous chemicals like mercury and cyanide. And suffice to say, there was not many occupational health and safety rules in place to protect those kids. They're also forced into other activities like begging in markets and so on. So these are people um, who are being trafficked and then diverted into secondary illegal activities.